Ladies and gentlemen, this is I, Terry Shaw, talking back to Rosie Prince Vagil with that Prince Blind. You did that because epilogue. Yeah, okay? Repeat that for me, please. Jesus. Oh, no one's here. Maybe he's in the bathroom? Did you intend in the infirmary? Oh, Saishu, sit down on the table. Okay. I just saw Judy Curtin reviewing his daddy's table. She didn't turn back to the room to search for medicine. Uh, my Akasan? Mm -hmm. I lied about the sonic pains. Huh? Truth is hurt and her expression dumbfounded. No, it's not it hurts. It's my cock. Eh? Huh? It's so sore and it hurts. Uh, 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 so, uh, uh, Sorry. The act is slightly embarrassed for me. There's a shot across her face. You turn around and sit behind the curtain with me. The curtain, we heard the door open. She's the doctor. Push by your guest's mind as if in fear. I could ride heat, so I'm making cock even harder. Here's some rush around, probably getting ready to go home. Then there's a hook, and the room went dark. <laughs> That's close, because need to hide though. See, that was gone now. Well, I got a little excited. Too bad she realized we were alone in the loft room together. You know, I saw time we were swimming. I nodded. I see. Let me have a look. Sure. Hurry way down the tail before she changed her mind. Jeff I was allowed to be a cop to see the end of the day in a very sexy way. Two odd looks from the security guards on duty at the gate, but we managed to get out safely. Bad that Akka's not worth it, probably saved us. Oh, I feel so white. White? I'm totally exhausted. Uh, well, it sounds like a fresh, but I couldn't say that out loud, so I just flashed and said. Well, yeah, I'm tired too. We sat for a really long time. We just swing a bit. <laughs> True. I'm sorry, you see all your essence doesn't really fill the belly. You want essence? Can you go to Proctor and Moonrock? Sure, let's do it. I'm not gonna mad at me for not eating the door on bread and then I cut all the short. I'll treat them with my paycheck. Oh, I can't wait to do that. Yep, you'll see that it'll make me happy to do it. Right here from Love Edge Decor. She's never done that before in my life, you know? We did tea and cake together, just the two of us. It was a little awkward, but it was kind of nice. I see. Now you guys have to reason to refuse. Yeah, leaves a little work student. This is going a bit too far. <laughs> Michelle wasn't far from where she worked, so we walked there arm in arm. This is a trivial monetary thing we would do together, and yet... Now it's alone again, I would look back on this as a beautiful shiny memory. Yeah, this is what I was saying, right? Yeah. Who regards you, Masaiku? Just kidding. Huh? 
、まだ一年もあるではなくて、あと一年しかないみたいな気持ちでいてほしいのよ。これが本当に。I'm just two to go, but it's only a year left, I mean. I mean it. 前にも言ったかもしれないけど、私はバンセンヌに通っていて、あんまり楽しいことってなかった。まさやくんが来るまでね。I have said this before, but I didn't have a lot of fun with it, that's not until you got there. I spent at, spent with you at school so much fun. How to put it to words, but yeah, I have very few good memories of my time in school too. The idea has been fun since I've been since last, I have a year left, but it's only a year. I agree with you. <laughs> yeah. Nice one's father agreed us as we arrived at the restaurant. I was even better move lately, too. I said to her after we put in our orders. <laughs> there he is. Even without my own drama, I finally has always been a little on edge. I saw towards the kitchen and smiled. That's true, but I feel like my parents have gone a lot closer. We sat together before, his expression had been pretty serious, possibly the subject of discussion, but the man who agreed us this time was very cheerful. Sorry about that. I just had her relationship with her daughter and ch had changed, it probably had positive effects on the entire family. So I was wondering. Hmm? Last time I wore the voice for some reason I went across the table to her. Masayaku, do you like to eat in public places? Huh? What are you saying? <laughs> you know, I went with you to the ball, Risiko's place too. Right. I think that was cut out. I don't remember that being mentioned or, or even hinted at. Can't forget that very passionate time we had spent together. I don't know that I like it. I mean that way. I mean that. <laughs> I was all over that car. It's not a crime or anything, so I don't see a problem. It's not like I want to do it outside or anything. I guess I just don't have a, a lot of self control. Just leave it over here, like For only a year apart. I don't want to talk. I didn't exactly object back then. <laughs> Not mine either. The idea of getting in the mood and just letting your body take over. It's a very passionate thing for lovers, you know? <laughs> we see each other very often, so it's only natural that we all get, we get all hot and bothered. Yeah, I'm glad you're okay with it. <laughs> That's not good amusement. It feels a little relieved. It's a meal. It would have been a while since I'd eaten there, and as usual, it was as delicious as it, as it was extravagant. Who's planning to go with this until some vacation? We can go to the beach together then. Yeah, I can't wait. <laughs> Neither can I. Ah, that's right, speaking of some vacation, it's not a festival. <laughs> what about the summer festival? Last time I said we should go together again next this year. I know, I just mentioned it. Well, the next year was still a festival wearing Yukata. Just saying, I want to jinx it by taking Kakawa next year. <laughs> yeah, but there was that, but like, you got quite a memory. So you've done a whole other route? I had forgotten. I never forget it, that. I really want to see you in Yukata. In Yukata. <laughs> I don't have Yukata. Ah. 
Is this hair that badly? Yes. Okay, is there. Or should I get one before the summer festival then? Sorry. They'll be. They'll be. I suppose they really need one for now. I just didn't want to go to some festivals. If that was someone to go with, maybe it wouldn't be bad to have one. Yeah, can't wait to see it. They know where I may be in a year. Those things are like promised, didn't they? That sounds about peacefully. That sounds seems convinced that Tag went next to his plans with Jinx it. Glad I reminded you. So you totally better not forget. I nodded. <laughs> now I'm looking forward to it too. Alright, another part two, huh? Nearly three months have passed since Gold Week, my long way to summer vacation arrived. The all important summer festival was still, was still ways off, but I was really, still really excited for what was to come. I tried not to see how I could ever wanted to. She emailed me to let me know if she was at the dorm. She really hurried out of my room. No. Salutations. Oh, where's your son? Are you coming with us? This is why we said we we'll go home anyway. I saw her. You buy me a Sasa? No, not at all. Never mind, we're just as heavy as we were when we first met, right? That's not what I was referring to. Well, I feel the generous guy. Then you might not mind. I was a son, I was a grown up a lot since she graduated. Oh, is that true? Was that you so silly? Ow! That's not what I was talking about, but... Yep. So we can note of this here. Yeah. I haven't changed all that much, so it's just like always. That's not what I meant. Sure she's going up? <laughs> As we walked out with Mr. Chan, how we were getting in the mindset of joining life when we were together. It was like Akasan had just it, and prepared ourselves for the future. We didn't see each other at all before Golden Week. Wow. Mr. Chan seemed genuinely impressed. So like she was working a harder job, too. Yes, I've heard about her job. So you have a shirt, sister. We well, like that. You have to go a bit after you graduate. This is how powerful the gravitational pull of the zest is. Yes. Which has been for the better, and so thanks my incredible boyfriend. I was moved too, so I can't complain. Seriously. So, the truth is, well, yeah? 
I'm so happy to say hi today. Huh? I don't think you are just yet. Just pat me on the shoulder. That's all serious. Just she was so hardy before. She just says she wants to apologize. Ah. I tensed up because I was surprised, but now that I thought about about it, it wasn't all that strange. Maybe Chris has sell the new term that the headmistress had talked up quite a bit. Harry, I think you should be with her. Sure, how am I going to see her at all? And so we made our way to the Kito Mikado residence. I read the house once before. It was the night before Yaka san and I had made love for the first time. It was when we came to tell him Mrs. that we were dating. The reception she gave us had been extremely chilly. I never thought I'd be coming back around us with all these different circumstances. Now, so I live at home now that you graduated, right? Yeah, you're probably get a place on my own, but there's no reason for that now. <laughs> oh, sorry, look at my room. It's a huge mess. I hear you. <laughs> so, this room too. We should try to keep your room clean. Mies is Modius. No, it can't be as Modius. I only have the one. It's the weirdest thing. Look, wait a second, the force coming out of nowhere. It must have very something like that. Of course. I just case it's towards you, towards you, Hey, Mrs. bowed her head deeply. Not at all. That was how his father sat beside her, serious expression on his face. He didn't hold any hard feelings about what had happened, so I wasn't sure how to respond. I decided, I decided not just shaking my head. Then see my canal, so I shot a few more words. I don't even think about it anymore. I just looked at me and seemed relieved. Hey, because you hate us both and now you don't? I'm excited to see why you think that way. I understand it's not a place to say all the way, but you do seem to see each other very well. Please can you share Yaka well? Yes, ma'am. This is not a good of proper force. Well then. Now I saw his father's expression brightened and rose to his feet. So he goes hungry. Huh? Um, yeah, I guess so. I see I would uh, ask the question. Yes, I bet you are. Now it's satisfaction. Oh, you here? Why don't I make a homemade dinner? Uh, yes, sir. Can you help me, Sako? Eh? Certainly. Hey, this is up as disappears in the next room. So you were you know what you say? Sure. This has never happened before. Most moms ever done is called some friends over for these small tea parties. Look forward to it. I don't think we've ever done anything like this before. Yeah. I started in the evening, so I didn't leave the house until the long summer day was reaching its end. Now, son said that we'd like to be out late because she knew we would have dinner together. We sleep out so late. No problem. Buses were running this way, so I missed had called for a taxi. I still had a little time to kill before it arrived. It was possibly fun. Did you just say surprisingly? <laughs> What are we talking about? Even if she has changed, I bet you didn't know how that turned her, huh? Yeah, but it was fun because there was a pretty welcoming atmosphere over the whole thing, I guess. 
前は全然あんなんじゃなかったのよ。言わなくてもわかるだろうけど。You've been there for all. I guess you could probably guess that though. I know, I, I never thought about it that way, but I could certainly imagine. I also never really felt like a family either, so yeah, I'm glad you invited me. I see. About ten minutes later, the taxi arrived. Well, I'll be going for today. See you tomorrow, okay? Yeah, bye bye. There's a festival coming up. Ah, Kasai and I went out to buy Yukata. Your dad is going to an area. I didn't know about it until it just recently, too. Not much longer, huh? I can't wait. I guess I remind myself. I think you better than I would. I'd feel a little self conscious. This is what I was about. Basically, looks sunny in you, Kata. Oh, you. Of course, you. Saiku, you don't worry, Kata, for either, either? I nodded. You had a time to go to the summer festival. Crazy. The point you kind of can be a bit of a pain. I guess it won't be so bad once I learn how to do it, but... Oh, really? That's not especially if it becomes strangely serious. Maybe putting it on a route was difficult? Debatable. That's why it teaches me how to do it. Is it really that difficult to learn? Uh, uh, probably not. I don't think anyway. Hmm? I couldn't really understand why she was acting this way. Upon arrival, I began wandering around and looking at the shops, wares, in earnest. They were all handmade by artisans and we had, and they had price tags to match, but the clerk said they were made to be worn for a lifetime. I had about an hour and a long discussion with the clerk, I asked on picked each other with a chrysanthemum and butterfly pattern. <laughs> that being kind of fun. This was a good thing to buy. She was very satisfied with her, pur with her purchase. I tell her to look at the material that was high, you call you Kala, but I was so eager to see her that I could barely show myself. Tell that it's going to be a long wait. Yeah, the cows did rain across the heavens. Yeah. The last time I around it brought fair weather along with it. it. Didn't seem likely that it would rain. Look at have it, the forecast was clear on the day of the festival. When the bus ride at a usual stop, a girl in Yukata got on board. Hello. So I started holding the hanging shafts and I couldn't help but stare. I feel like this squee or a bus is something going more beautiful. How do you like it? It looks amazing on you. Glad to hear it. I was on struck little pole showing it off to me. Looked up from my seat, drinking in the sight. Step beside me, and the now exposed nape from neck got my heart pounding unusually hard. Um, it's really good. I just lost my head. What the hell? Now it sounds sad, swinging your feet. Can't look down at them. Oh, it rains down today. It was looking ensemble, right? Yeah, it's nice you've totally coordinated your outfit. <laughs> That's just the top way it's coordinated, and this was underneath you kind of properly too. Underneath? <laughs> so I blushed and I couldn't figure out what she was getting at. Huh? These are all those things when Tokyo girls assess over the pattern of their underwear? <laughs> If you just felt the pattern, then it wouldn't. Then it, then it being proper wouldn't matter. 
That's true. I'll tell you later. Yeah. I smell a sweet aroma as you mean in the mission mayor. It must be a hard scoop of beat. She was wearing makeup and perfume, but of course there was more than that. We made love. Part of, me, part of what made me lose my mind wasn't the self by but the sweet side of hers. I mean, it seems really cool, actually, wasn't it? Oh, yes, I was mentioning it. Think it was the same this year? Turn my eyes toward the station and noticed that it was more crowded than usual. So you kind of had festival goers here and there, so the chain would likely be packed up again. In the back on, I felt pretty strange back then. I felt pretty strange back then. Huh? Why strange? Um, well, I got drunk and it was all over you, remember? And we we'll planned to see if that was... A train? Or a body touch. The excitement I had felt back then, ha then had spurred my later actions. So you for the passengers, right? I nodded. We were dating back then, so I realized how presumptuous my hair had been. But it was still what I wanted to do. Do you say this year too? I mean, given how I'm dressed. Of course. So, to be honest, I'm a little nervous. Nervous? Uh, well, now let's go. I got some pulling by the hand towards the same station. Nervous? I got understand being nervous that she was still living in business, but this is the Aka. This was the Aka who was holding me down a part time job. I can't imagine why you're getting out of shame and being nervous. Oh, no big deal. That was a protection. That's all. Ah, oh, so soft. So warm. You know, the middle of the car train I was getting turned on. I really wasn't mad with that honor. Oh, Virginia, so you can act so shamelessly. Now I was as though to my ears so that only I could hear. I don't need to worry. I wrapped her arms around me. She held me in tightly and I felt her two soft pillow, pillow press against my chest. So I protected her, but now we were just all hugging in a crowded train. We really become the stereotypical obnoxious couple. Next time, let's play Princess Vangel with happiness blind. I like the vlog. Continues. Till then.